Welcome to Dave's Cooking Show, and it's time for another tale of when I was Dave, chef to the stars. And this is the time that Jessica Beale came into my humble little establishment, begging and pleading for a penny she would never forget. So I said, okay. First thing we do is we start off by cooking up two pounds of mild Italian sausage. Okay, as you can see here, the sausage is done. So time to drain off the excess fat and then return the pot to the uh, burner. All right, see you at the next step. Okay, as you can see here, we have the um, sausage all drained. Now let's add that back into the mix. And now we're going to add two cans of San Marzano tomatoes uh, that I basically pureed up in my blender here. That is two 28-ounce cans of San Marzano tomatoes. And you want to give that a good little mix up there. Just stir it around, make sure everything's mixed. And then you want to add a half a teaspoon of fennel and a quarter teaspoon of ground sage. Now, ordinarily, I would add garlic, but Miss Beale started screaming like a lunatic, demanding that I don't. So, even though this recipe didn't have any garlic in it, it still turned out fantastic. And lastly, salt and pepper to taste. You also wanna add just a pinch of sugar. Not for any flavoring purposes, but to just kind of take the tinniness of the can away. So, that's uh, pretty much really it. Um, simmer this for at least 15, 20 minutes or so. Um, and then you also want to start uh, getting the penne water uh, boiling. And of course, salt the water. You want pasta water to be as salty as the sea. And then again, take a minute off of the minimum cook time. And that's really all you do with the pasta. And just make sure you taste this throughout the cooking process to adjust any and all seasonings uh, to taste. One last thing, this is optional, but you wanna make sure you add a bay leaf because, you know, they taste like bay leaves. Anyway, just make sure you uh, remove it about five minutes before you uh, uh, kill the heat with the sauce. Okay, as you can see, we got our pasta cooked al dente. Nice little penne there. And I decided to do it a little differently. I didn't put the pasta with the sauce. I decided this time just to serve the sauce on top of the pasta. For whatever reason, that's what Miss Beale demanded. And then just to finish this off, a little bit of freshly ground Parmesan cheese and a little bit of freshly ground black pepper. And that is Jessica Beale's penne. Done.